Sam. They're doing it again. Sam? There is an alternate route. Overriding the door now. Nope. The Keta hardening their security. Try scanning the access panel. The door is voice activated. I can attempt to modulate your vocal cords to approximate Ket intonation. Okay. The system is asking for your authorization. How do you wish to respond? Access denied. Intruders have been spotted on the ship. We need to secure this area. Access granted. Impressive, but also disturbing. Well, could be their scientists. So what are they up to? Shit! Weird. Only useful if you have something to hide. Keep that company! We gotta get through these guys! They are dead. Be easier if the cat just handed the relic over. We could all save on ammo. I think we just found all the stasis pods. Maybe this alert. Oh my God. What is this? Who could do this kind of thing? Someone's going to pay for this. Get your anger out on them. Bastards! We're not lab animals. That felt good. Sam, how's it looking? The Archon's chamber will record. Rider, caution. Some kind of... Uh, immobilizing field. It's useless to struggle. I've been in this forsaken cluster for decades, surrounded by amoeba. Then you arrive, a human able to do the unthinkable. You even evaded me. Such an unlikely rival was almost invigorating to have one. And yet, it's a fitting end. You have no idea what you're messing with. Now I suggest you let... Hey, back off, asshole. A first son. The testing begins now. I will learn your secrets soon enough. Report. Await my arrival. Save your strength, human. Reka must have run into trouble. We have her beat. Sam, what can you tell me? I'm sensing a biological transmitter in your bloodstream now. Attempting to neutralize it. Okay, that's priority two for sure. Any idea how to break out of this? The containment fields only interact with living matter. If you expire, the field around you will extinguish until manually reset. 
As you know, my access to your physiology allows me to enhance your vital signals when required. I can also do the opposite. So if you shut down my life signs, if you kill me, the field will disappear? The one holding you, yes. Then I would attempt to resuscitate. Are there any other options? None that I can determine. All right. Let's do it. Not again. It has been a pleasure. Stop in your heart. Now. Sam? Stimulating the cardiovascular core. Zero activity. Stimulating the cardiovascular core. That seems to have done the trick. Of course it did. Glad one of us was sure. You two look comfortable. So did you, while you were playing dead. Let's find a way out of this cage, huh? There is a maintenance corridor connecting to this room. Okay. Must be a way to access it. I'll look for it. Could be useful intel here. We should check this area out while we can. Good little mom, little! Step away from there!
Is that a Krogan? It was. Probably one of Drek's missing scouts. The DNA is Krogan, but drastically altered. It's clear the cats are closing in on successfully exalting the species. <sighs> They're driven and efficient, that's for sure. Captain Hager, this is Ryder. We've reached the Archon's sanctum. Give the word and we'll set off the EMP. Should disable the guns. The Archon has done it. Why does he care so much about the Remnant? It's an obsession. That's the question, isn't it? And we need to beat him to the answer. Pathfinder, this is the relic the Moshe described. It does seem to be a map. I'll overlay the chart we uncovered in the vault on Eos. So that's... Meridian. Coordinates secured, Pathfinder. So that's what you're after. There's more to Meridian than you know. Changing the weather is a fraction of its power, and I will not allow you to defile it. You didn't allow me to escape your little trap either, did you? I wasn't you. It was the artificial intelligence in your head. I've seen what transpired in the laboratory, and now I know what makes you... special. Meridian is mine. I've tolerated you long enough. Once your vessels are destroyed, you'll be stranded here. Captain, fire the EMP! Done! Be good. signs on board the ship. Several captives are being held not far from your location. They are scheduled for exaltation. Could be the rest of Drax's missing scouts. Sam, do we have time to get there before the Kev restore power? If you act quickly. Ryder, it's Reka. I'm pinned down. Don't think I'm gonna make it. Where are you? Near holding cells where they're keeping several of my people. They're still alive. 
I ordered Captain Hager back to the Ark. You should be with him. I couldn't leave my people. I had to try. And now, I think it's over. From one Pathfinder to another, farewell. Reka out. Damn it! There isn't time to save both. Once the cat restore power, you'll be trapped. <sighs> this is the last chance for drug scouts. The Archon will turn them into monsters. Reload. We've got to save those Kroger from exaltation. Who are you? Pathfinder Rider, we're here to rescue the prisoners. Who are you? Bertek, a scout from Nightmore Drag. I got loose when the power went out, but I can't do this alone. My people are being held at the end of the corridor, with a lot of Ked in the way. Then we push ahead and don't stop for anything. Let's go. Get ready. Ked, up ahead. About to be dead, Ked. We have to punch through! Long way between here and there! Or you're welcome to hang back and die! Tempest, this is Ryder. You copy? I hear you, Pathfinder. We have the map, but we're trying to rescue some prisoners. But those Ket guns won't stay offline forever. I know, I know. Just tell us if anything changes. You'll be the first to know. Kalo out. Can you run? Pathfinder, the cats are close to restoring the ship's power. Tempest, we're going topside. Track for extraction. Understood. Reka. Reka, are you still there? I'm sorry.
A team is on its way. They'll escort the Ark to the Nexus. I'm sure they'll be happy to see you, Captain Hager. It's a day I wasn't certain would ever come. Now that it has, what will you do? Technically, I'm next in line to be our Pathfinder, though I never started the training. Reiko will be difficult to replace. I won't lie. When my father died, stepping up was overwhelming. There's a lot to learn. Though it seems your crew helped? Absolutely. Just get yourself a half-ton Krogan and all your problems are solved. What matters most is that the Salarian people are no longer at the mercy of the Ket. For this, we are eternally grateful. Just make sure my scouts make it safely to Nexus. Of course. Be well, Ryder. I heard all about the mission. Must have been a tough call leaving Reka behind. But I'm glad you did. My scouts are alive because of it. Yeah, but the Salarians we left behind. Focus on what went right. You kicked the Archon's tail today. You took the Ark right out from under him and got Meridian's location. So, enjoy this one. Your father would have been proud. It's been tough, trying to fill his shoes. I hope I'm finally starting to earn it. Though slapping the Archon in the face like this will only make him more dangerous. Or perhaps reckless. Your father liked putting others off balance. He said the worthy would rise above it and learn to face adversity ably. And the unworthy? Would crumble. I'll leave you to your thoughts. With reference, Archon, this fascination with Meridian cannot continue. It's the key to our future, Primus. The human knows nothing of its true power. Even we don't fully understand it. Our orders are to exalt this cluster, not study the remnant. Questions are being asked about your judgment. Questions that come from the highest levels. The answers will be clear soon enough. With Meridian, we can transform every world in this cluster to a wasteland. Either the subjects submit to exaltation, or we will use it to annihilate them. This Pathfinder has opened the door. Now we must be the first to cross the threshold. We must seize Meridian before it does. Like all lesser creatures, it mistakes a battle for the war. It doesn't know its weakness. Or its potential. The Archon saw my memory flashes? He got that from my implant? His device went deep. Our connections were wide open when Sam... killed you. We hit him once. We focus on doing it again. We have to rally the Nexus and move on Meridian.
Pathfinder, you have new email. I hope. A lot of your people were lost. We came to Andromeda because we had a contribution to make. The cat won't take that away. Move your arm again? Readings won't change, Doc. Your prosthetics are sinking properly. Your neuropathy-induced pain levels are... consistent. Hey, I'm used to it. It's okay. No, it's not okay. You keep fighting smart, you hear me? You don't have much left in terms of organ redundancies. <clears throat> nah, it's fine. I don't mind. What's all this about? Follow-up scans. I keep a close eye on him. What do you mean? He's fine, just old and missing too many parts. And too stubborn for his own good. You love me just the way I am, Doc. Hmm. Don't get off that table until the scan is done. Can I ask what happened? Arm, side, hip, part of my leg. Strain balancing threading across my spine. It's all prosthetics and implants. That's... a lot. Made it through the Krogan Rebellions, watched my culture disintegrate, survived centuries as a merc, and all sorts of pirate shenanigans. A thousand years of combat experience, all it took was one idiot with a pack of frag grenades. But you're here, still standing. You survived. Yeah, but surviving ain't always living. I hit some dark moments. Implant rejection after implant rejection. Prosthetics not sinking properly. Everything hurt. A lot. All the time. No purpose to anything. How did you deal with it? I didn't. I fell right into that pit. Almost. But then some shaman shows up, drops the tiniest little baby girl in my lap. This one's dying, he said. Not worth the trouble, he says. Useless is what he meant. He wasn't just talking about the baby. Yeah, I was useless too, but... Wasn't just about me anymore. 
so I got help. Learned how to take care of myself, take care of her, and she took care of me. You found a way to live again. We sure did. Wasn't easy on either of us. I'm old, stuck in my ways, and Cash... Cash has wanted to change everything since she could talk. Raising Cash taught me an important lesson. What was it? Took me a while to figure it out, but it's important. Parents aren't meant to be a goal or a finish line. We're the starting line. Where you go from there, it's all you. Remember that. Got a minute? I could use a favor. Sure, what do you need? I kept thinking about Sarissa and my not being a pathfinder. And the thinking turned into a project on EOS. Can you help me finish it? What kind of project? I'll put the nav points in the helm. Come along and I'll show you. and Prodromos. Green. Coordinating. Path is calm.
place. Ready? So where's your mystery project? Not far. Soil converter. No remnant terraformer, but it makes sandy dirt into something useful. Eventually. Add seeds, some rain, and you've got a garden. That's right. You wanted a garden of your own. It'll take years. I might not even see it. But that's okay. Asari think in centuries. Lay a foundation, then step away. Let it grow into something you might never expect. Pathfinder training was my foundation. Gave me a whole galaxy of directions I could go. I don't need someone else's plan. Just a good beginning. The first seeds of a garden. One I started with my friend. What seeds do you have? Desert flowers and grasses from across the Milky Way. Colors we don't even have names for. When they've prepared the ground. Roses, someday. Ready? One, two, I'm good. You're here. Yeah, so listen. She's only got a minute or two, and she's in rare form today, just to warn you. She's here kick-starting repopulation protocols, reversing the chemical procreation blockers for colonists. Calls it boosting the batter. She's gonna talk your ear off about your civic duty as a man. Then she'll find out what a skillful topic changer I am. Good luck with that. The woman's tenacious. I mean, makes no never mind to me. No chance I'll ever oops a baby into the world. It does bring something to mind about us, though. Us? Yeah. When I'm this attracted to someone and they seem receptive normally, well, things start happening. I'm trying to give whatever this is between us the thought and attention it seems to deserve. So I have to know, do I introduce you to Jill as my friend who likes to flirt, or my guy? I think maybe we should just be friends. All right, that's fine. I've liked from afar before. I know how it works. Am I interrupting something? Ah, Jill, about time. This is... Save it. I asked you both to stop by, remember? Ryder, pleasure. I know we're all very busy, so I have only one question for you. Sure, go ahead. What the hell did you do to him? 
It's like he's an adult or something. He can even have a mature conversation without it degrading into pot shots. Unless I take it there. And what's your secret? I have nothing to do with it. It's all him. I call bullshit on that. It's definitely your influence. Something. Maybe all these years you thought you knew me, you were sadly mistaken. You wish. Okay, you're both off the hook. So glad I got to meet you, Ryder. Likewise. Ascent is go. Leaving Atmel. All clear. Can we talk when you're free? I need a break. Do you need a break? Let's go for a break. Care for some tea, Ryder? I'd love a cup. It's a cultivar originating in Sumatra. My own personal stash. Once I run out, that'll be it for Earth Tea. I keep having these thoughts. I'm never gonna taste this again. Never gonna see that again. I don't want to seem harsh, but there's really no take backsies with this one. I know, I can't do anything about it, which is why I wish my brain would behave itself. The universe is like a giant tapestry. I love following its threads, but it distracts me from the whole picture. My family was right there, but I was too occupied by the abstract to appreciate them. You're a pioneer in a new galaxy. Your family understood that, and they were proud of you. Your work as a scientist will help thousands of people. That's real. It was a dream for all of us. They always encouraged me. I will do all I can to make sure my work honors them. Thank you, Ryder. Morda just calmed in. 
Scouts are expected to arrive soon and medics are on standby. I won't forget this, Ryder. You chose Krogan first. It's been a long time since anyone's seen us as anything other than cannon fodder. I couldn't let you down. My crew is like family. Only family I've had for a long time is Kesh. Guess anything can change. So, about that bar fight on Kadara, was that like... a date? Nah, there'd be less of an audience, and more property damage. Are you happy now that Spender's out of the picture? Damn right I am. Maybe they'll forget to feed him while he's locked up. Breaks your hearts, huh? Heh, <laughs> heart. Just got the one left. Got any stories or advice to share? Does a pie jack scratch its butt? Tell me about the first time you fought someone. That'd be my first battle. It was during the Krogan Rebellions. I was just some snot-nosed brat back then, but my mother wanted me to get experience. At first, it was the best day of my life. And then my mother died on the battlefield. We can talk more later. Sure. Hey, Pathfinder. Still passing that mess with Varan and Khaled. I made sure the Nexus data will be changed. Kesh is none too happy, but she can blame me. The important bit is you. I want you to know I understand your decision, and Varan does as well. Accepted, Liam. But let's not do this again anytime soon. Oh, total agreement there. In fact, this made me think how I'm doing a lot of things. I've arranged a thing, on EOS, for everyone. It's time I gave back, not just go from crisis to crisis. Sam has the nav points, dress light. that even if I do find it, it's gonna cost you. And you know I'm always true to my word, so just get it done. I'm hearing the Ket activities down. I bet the Archon's still nursing his wounds. That means he can be beaten. The Ket can be beaten. People are waking up to that. Didn't sound like you were discussing Ket over comms when I walked in, though. Wasn't. I have a friend keeping a lookout for a lamp. One brought from home, but stolen in the revolt. You were mad at Sid for wanting non-essentials. Now you're using contacts to find a lamp? Maybe Sid had a point. The small things keep us going. Suvi has her father's antique instruments, Cora her Asari prayer book, and Liam has... the junk that Liam collects. These things are important. They remind us where we came from. We came here to secure our future. We can't do that if we're still looking back. You have to look back to see how far you've come. So what's so special about this lamp? It's awful. It's got a butt-naked Asari for the stand, and she's holding... a moon. One of your prized possessions is a really ugly lamp? The foreman at my first job had this lamp. When he was mean, I'd focus on it so he wouldn't see me upset. Now I keep it so I remember where I started. Most of my life was doing stuff to survive, taking shit from assholes, or being one. 
I don't have to do that anymore. I can start over. Something honest. Do you really want to start over? After everything you've been through? I don't know. The point is, I have the choice of changing if I wanted to. For a while, I didn't care that I'd lost the lamp. Everything was a mess and it just didn't matter. But we've made progress, Ryder. Small things matter again. People are daring to dream. We'll get you the lamp, even if it's not the same one. We'll make you a new one. If we make new ones, we'll have to get you one too. We need to talk about Sam. Dr. Taparo does not approve of how we escaped the Ket containment field on the Archon's flagship. By stopping the Pathfinder's heart? No, I do not approve. We didn't have a choice. If there had been another option, I would have taken it. How can you be so calm about this? Ryder, Sam killed you. Yes, he brought you back, but what if he didn't? I cannot learn without the Pathfinder. That would be akin to killing a part of myself. Your lines of code, you can't die. Sam would never hurt me. Thank you, Scott. <sighs> Look, I'm not against Sam. I'm not against you, Sam. But my job's hard enough without an AI stopping your heart. Even to save your life. Your concern is noted, Doctor. Of course it has. Lexi, I apologize for any distress I have caused you. <sighs> and I'm sorry for calling you lines of code. You're more than that, even if you don't have cells to prove it. Archon barely sees us as sentient, strings people up like puppets. Didn't know Sam could do that to his Pathfinder. You sure you're okay? Just a lingering bruise or two. My vitals are good. Let's hope that sample he took isn't a problem. Losing another Pathfinder is... <sighs> At least the cat can't exalt the Krogan. Sorry, rambling. Did you need me? See you later, Cora. I'll be here. Hugely inefficient. 
Are you still trying to figure out how to eat Helios flora? Oh, shoot. I was talking out loud again, wasn't I? The scent is green. Coordinating. Path is calm. Liam marked something nearby. He should be here for it. This was Liam's plan. He should be here for this. Dromos is suited up and ready to host. Ready for the exchange, Pathfinder. Grab your civvies. Going to get hot. How did you do all this? Well, it didn't take much. A ball, flat ground. Hustle would start games at refugee camps. I didn't get it then, but after the attack here and the shit with Varan's rescue, I wanted to try something. Low tech. What do you think? It's good to get people's minds off of all the crap we go through. Not just that. I didn't do it to distract them. We don't get distracted. We go head on. When it's life or death, you have to. No one's living or dying because of this. They're here because they want to be. I didn't get how important that is. Maybe that choice is how we stop being outsiders. Check the play! Free kick for charging! No charge for matchmaking. <laughs> what? Thanks, Liam. For what? Building on what you started? If you like. <laughs> right. Well, you're welcome. Switch up. Ready to get in the game? Yeah. The Pathfinder should make an appearance. Try to keep up, Costa! Don't count on it. I'm complete rubbish. <laughs> Ascent is go. Leaving Atmel. All clear. Welcome back. Pathfinder, you have new email. Tinkadara.
Pathfinder. This area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. I think Fetra wanted to show me something close by, but she's not here. You were right. The view is great from up here. We're not even to the top yet. Come on, I'll race you. And no jump jets. We're doing it the old-fashioned way. What do I get if I win? What would you like? Competitors don't usually get to choose their reward. That's how they do it in the Milky Way. We should switch things up for Helios. Having fun? You look like you're having fun. Scott, is this real? Yeah, I think the sky's real. No. This. How you are towards me. It's like you... care more than a friend. I don't mind if it's no. I just want to be sure it gets messy otherwise. I didn't intend that. I thought we were just playing. Oh. Well, good. At least it's clear. It's all going to be like this, huh? No. Better. For 14 months, I wondered if I'd made a mistake coming here and dragging my sister with me. I don't wonder anymore. Boarding the Tempest that day was the best decision I ever made. I'm glad you came aboard, too. It wouldn't have been the same without you.
Welcome back. Now orbiting Kadara. Entering atmosphere, LZ in sight. John! John! <laughs> Wait. Is that bad news? No, no. The Pathfinder is interested in where I grew up. Ryder, this is my true mother, Sahuna Amadarao. Hello. Giles told me how much he admires you. Really? He's my favorite. Smart, loyal, kind. A great shot. Writes poetry, souls... <clears throat> Mother. <clears throat> <laughs> I'm late for a resistance meeting. Stay clear. Your mother's in the resistance? <laughs> yes. And every child is her favorite. Everyone, this is Scott. Hi. Look who the car can drag with. Welcome back. This is where I spent most of my days growing up. Me, my sister, Guana, our cousin, Etta, and brother, Finn. Then, Bavezil, Rolu. So wonderful to Ejal, have you back. A human. Jal, you bring in someone special to meet us. Wow. Cozy. We like to live like this. Gonna give your friends some real food? Good to see you. And here's my room. My... Tiny sanctuary. You must dream of a big place of your own. Sometimes. <laughs> Maybe. Doesn't matter. This will always be my home. Oh, no. Who put this here? Schematics? Of... When I was seven, my aunt stole a cat weapon for me. So I took it apart. To learn. And that is, was, a Karkin. Pet Karkin. <laughs> All fit. He died. So I also took him apart. To learn? Why not? I never show people these things, but I feel like we're family. I'm glad Ephra threw you on my ship. Hey, there's one more thing you might like. Sit there. Been interesting so far. Hmm. 
Nice. You made that? Long ago. It's not accurate. More of a dream, really. Just one more thing I want to take apart and figure out. Me too, Joel. Me too. All systems green. Batarian pioneer, their first astronaut. It's good to remember these things. I'm picking up something. Probes launched. Got a reading from the asteroid belt. Anomaly on sensors. Deploying probe. We've got a crater. Drax's theories, a real Turian aeronaut, the first across the ocean in a balloon. On Paladin? Brave soul. There aren't many soft places to land. Anomaly on sensors. Probes launched. Detecting what's left of a ship.
are picking up something. Deploying probe. Anomaly found. One of the most remote systems in the cluster. We're on the brink. Exciting, isn't it? Anomaly on sensors. Probe away. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. The sight of this cluster is so different. Maybe the Scourge is absorbing certain wavelengths. Does it ever give anything back? Anomaly detected. I found something. Picking up something. Probe away. Anomaly found.
Anomaly on sensors. Probes launched. Detecting what's left of a ship. on course. 